Hey friends, Samuel Schaus here, Kelly Williams, Big Island. We're here to talk about cesspools, septic tanks, and the good and the bad. Coming up. Hey, so one thing you really need to keep in mind is 75% of this island's single family homes is currently still on cesspool on this island. So they almost never fail. They almost never need to be pumped. So the, the pretty maintenance free. Now I say almost is because I have seen some occasions where they have been problematic, but really only because someone did something illegal, like adding another bathroom onto their house or another sink, anything like that to add added flow to the cesspool pool which could create issues. So a cesspool is basically an open pit in the ground 8 to 12 feet deep with a concrete cover so they're hard to spot and even the concrete cover is usually below the soil so they're really hard to spot. So the best way to find out where your cesspool is if you don't know is to contact the wastewater branch department and generally use this as an example. If your house is built before 1980, eight times out of 10, they may not have anything on file for your home. They just did a poor job back then of record keeping. Now, if they do have something on file for you, 50-50 chance you can actually read what they write. Yeah, I know, it's that bad. Anyway, by 2050, they all have to be upgraded to septic. Now that date could change in the future, we don't know, but by 2050, all homes on cesspools need to be upgraded to a septic system. Also, all new construction can no longer use cesspool. It all has to be septics. Now, there have been some reports of pollution with cesspools, especially along the coastline areas, hence the reason why they're making so many people upgrade to septic tanks. Now, they can cost upwards of 15 to 25 grand for the installation. Uh, just depends on what type of soil you have and what you're digging up. If you hit a big chunk of blue rock, you can guarantee you're going to be spending 25 or 30 grand on installing your septic tank. So keep that in mind. Generally, the septic tanks need to be pumped annually. So there is some maintenance involved and watch out for gang cesspools. So some properties will come on the market with more than one home on the lot. And if each home feeds into one cesspool, the EPA calls that a gang cesspools. And if the lender finds out if you're using financing, if the lender finds out about the gang cesspools, they may shut down your whole loan and make the deal contingent upon the upgrade of a septic system. So Samuel Schaus here, Keller Williams Realty, Big Island. Happy to help you with anything at all. Answer all your crappy questions. I will talk to you soon. Thank you.